Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe. The best in the world! Making his way to the ring from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, CM Punk! Well, CM Punk made his return with a flood of emotions, but he knows he now has unfinished business and a story of his own to complete. After nearly a decade away from WWE, Punk can still compete at a high level, and he'll need that with today's competitors. A polarizing figure, but Punk is determined to be the best. Punk's return was an amazing moment, but now he must capitalize. Yeah, easier said than done because the competition is now at an all-time high. Is being the best in the world still good enough? Well, here comes the Scottish warrior. Carrying his trusted blade, Angela, McIntyre summons the support of the WWE Universe into battle. The Scottish Warrior outlasted 29 other superstars to win the 2020 Royal Rumble match and then carried that momentum all the way to WrestleMania, where he became WWE Champion. It's hell in a cell, so we know there are no disqualifications or countouts. You can only walk out of that demonic structure a winner for your pinfall or submission. The Hell in a Cell is one of the most brutal and dangerous matches in the history of WWE. Just look through the analog history to see what havoc has been wrought in that steel cage enclosure. Well, they call it Hell in a Cell for a reason. It was easy to call it Picnic in the Park or something. But your point is well taken, Byron. Victory must be won inside the ring, and anything not nailed to the ground can be used as a weapon. This is where the dark forces of evil are unleashed. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. Talk about dismantling your opponent. Momentum is really on Punk's side. CM Punk is stifling the opposition now. Oh, shoulder, elbow, all affected with that. And Drew's weathered tough offense all over the world. But that one caught him hard. What's CM Punk going for here? Caught with the backbreaker. Is it enough here? And he manages to kick out in one. 
Still no end in sight here. Ah, look at this. Just breaking down the opponent. It's not just a clever name. Hell in a Cell is the closest some people will ever come to Hell on Earth. We've seen the type of torture that's capable during this match. Uppercut connects. inside Hell in a Cell. Climbing blows. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. You'll be lucky if this is the worst he suffers in the cell. That's one way to bring down your opponent. Both arms captured and vitriolic stops. He can do it here. And he powers out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Assault from McIntyre. Bart needs to reformulate a strategy. <laughs> Boom! Strong counter from Punk. Sierra Punk doing what he can to alter the beatdown. He's hoping to start a rush of his own. This is not going to end well. Big time powerbomb. That was a powerbomb with one message in mind. Absolute destruction. Powerbomb. He's starting to struggle here. Yeah, McIntyre putting as much power on the top. Oh. Incoming. Oh. The top. Diving hammer strike. As we all know, Hell in a Cell matches tend to deteriorate once the competitors leave the confines of the ring. Oh, what an uppercut. So impactful. Ooh, stiff punch. Ooh, what an uppercut. Sure. I don't know if Punk can withstand much more of this. Next level brutality coming from McIntyre. He climbs into the ring. Looking for a scoop, Sam. No, slips behind. Inverted DDT. Excellent opportunity for Punk to shift the momentum. Time now for CM Punk to get his energy up and claw back into the fight. And that was a well-executed attack. Showing off their deadlifting prowess and just tossing their opponent like they're nothing. Impact brought 
to the knee. Here's the punt. Sure. Never underestimate the resiliency of the second city saint. That was supposed to be it. No one is more shocked right now than McIntyre. Now on the outside, right by those cell walls. from McIntyre. Punk needs to be resourceful. Find a moment to strike. CM Punk. Drew exhibiting all his power and force. Yeah, yeah. Ooh. Oh. That's Turns that back on CM Punk. Oh, that'll rally you. Drew McIntyre, a big win here tonight. McIntyre.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. That is for the WWE Women's Championship. All right, here comes Michael Cole's best friend. Great. Just about as merciless as they come. More than that, Bailey is out to humiliate her opponents, make a mockery of them. Well, maybe that's what they deserve for picking a fight with Bailey. No one deserves to be humiliated, Corey. I can think of one person here who does. We'll see if she'll rely on her skill or shortcuts tonight. Ooh, Cole, you are gonna get such a scolding tonight. This woman is the real deal. Here we go, guys. The championship is on the line here in this one. And I'll tell you, Cole, the champion has never looked more dominant than right here, right now. Facing one of the most talented in-ring competitors, but now also has to contend with Bailey's mean streak. Well, she is certainly going to have to tap into her ultra-aggressive side to overcome Bailey. Introducing the challenger from San Jose, California, Bailey! And her opponent from San Diego, California, the WWE Women's Champion, the Irresistible Force! Taking one final look at the title. WWE Universe anxiously awaiting the sound of the bell should be a hell of a match. WWE Women's Championship on the line here in this one. A lot of history with this title, and tonight, no doubt, these superstars hope to make history all over again. Who will stay claim to the top of the division? Who will walk away with the gold around their waist? Oh, it's punishing the right arm. You have to protect your shoulders from hits like that. You don't want to compromise your ability to throw a punch or lock in a hole. Jarring impact. Oh, what a knee strike. Oh, that'll weaken your arm. Watch out. Suicide dive! That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for their own well-being. <laughs> Bailey showing no answer for the attack. If Bailey can just weather this storm, she'll be fine. Corey Bailey is known for her preparedness in any type of match against any type of competitor. How do you out prepare, out adapt, out think it up? What a tank down the. Oh, there it is, the captain's hook. And can she break out back to her feet? A couple of elbows to the gut and create separation. Uh, ducked underneath. Instead, what a German suplex.
Got to find a way back into the ring now. Before the count. Oh, it's going to happen. You got to be kidding me. Going to be down on their opponent like a sack of bricks. And now thrown back into the ring. Cover by the challenger. She was close to the end there. If she keeps the pressure on, the next one might do it. She responds with a counter. Effective. The champion into the cover. The challenger wriggles out of one. It just could be a source of a lot of pride and honor in that championship. There are a few things that represent so many hopes and dreams as the women's championship. And there's no wonder why it's so highly contested. I expect we'll see that high level of competition between these women tonight. Oh, what a strike to the back. <laughs> Matt slam with some attitude. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. Look out. A huge impact. This is what it's going to take. You have to go all out if you want that title. Not even a near fall there. Ah, oh, kick. Nasty kick. Belly loves to be in control of a match to dictate the flow. Corey, is there an easy way to turn that against her? Oh, absolutely, Cole. If you can disrupt Bailey's rhythm and make things difficult for her, she'll start to get very frustrated. And even the best superstars get sloppy and make mistakes when they're flustered. Taken outside the dangerous territory. Now's the time to bring the fight to the champion. the mark. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. Oh, what a nasty knee lift. And yeah, guys, she's dangerously close to a count out loss. Places her right in the corner. In full control here. Face full of turnbuckle. Dismantling the arm in the corner. Gotta hurt. Searching for any advantage towards the title. <laughs> Trying to dismantle the champ's arm. Oh, and a close line. Oh, the elbow connects. The challenger eating up some damage. Setting up for something here. Oh, oh, the floor. Champ's got the pin to retain. The pin doesn't even last to a count of one. Staying in this one. Bailey turns it around. Oh! Bailey just mocking her now. Uh, she's just letting her know what she really thinks about her. She adjusts it and reverses it. Oh, that'll clean your clock. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. Trying to wrestle free their opponent's arm. Has the arm trapped. And a series of vicious stomps. The challenger with a rabid attack. Will the champ find an answer? Oh! 
Bailey fending that off. Kick right to the leg. Bailey's gaining the upper hand. You can't expect any sympathy from Bailey here. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Bailey zeroing in on her. <laughs> to the back of the knee. display of stamina. The champ showing they are truly worthy of this title. But things might only get harder from here. And Bailey can barely believe it. Bailey had her dead to right. Thought she had the three, but it was a factor of milliseconds. You can tell a fire has been lit inside of her. Momentum has clearly swung her way. She's calling for it. From the top. Side steps and countered into a backbreaker. She's able to stop the blitz that was coming her way. That could be the spark she was looking for. Oh, man, leg drop, arm breaker. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. A bad place to be for the challenger. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Side headlock takeover, nicely done. Tremendous pressure on the head and neck. Steer clear of that. That'll fillet your chest. Look at this going right after the left arm. Gotta hurt. <laughs> Headbutt. Now gonna drag their opponent toward the corner. Have to wonder what they have in store. Slowly up to the second row. Bonsai drop. The champ has his one to now. The champion retains. Here is your winner. And still, the WWE Women's Champion, the Irresistible Force. She came in the champ. She's leaving the champ. She knew to cement yourself as a true champion, you have to defend it. You have to become battle tech. It's Miss Money in the bank. As we get started here, let me remind everybody that the title is on the line here tonight. Yeah, but that's just a mere formality. The way I see it, there's no way we crown a new champion tonight. The challenger is all business. She's been training harder than ever for this title opportunity. Introducing the challenger from Prior Lake, Minnesota, Tiffany Stratton. And her opponent from San Diego, California, the WWE Women's Champion, the Irresistible Force. Tonight is about earning the privilege to hold this title, the WWE Women's Championship. You can see a burning desire in the eyes of each athlete, knowing that the top of the mountain is on the winning side of this match. WWE Women's Championship on the line here in this one. A lot of history with this title, and tonight, no doubt, these superstars hope to make history all over again. Who will stay claim to the top of the division? Who will walk away with the goal around their waist? Great counter, impressive ring IQ on display there. Sharp chop. Face first, good night. Ooh, elbow strike. 
strike. The champion's down. The champion's down. Oh, my God. We're going to have a new champion. Barely kicks out. She is still fighting, still keeping this going. Oh, yeah, oh look at this. Hair pull mat slam. Debilitating attacks like that are exactly how you create a big opening. No! Suicide dive! Throwing all costs into the wind and leaping to the outside. Tiffany Stratton is still a relative newcomer to sports entertainment, still a somewhat unknown quality as far as competitors go. With that in mind, Corey, what do you think we can expect to see from her in this one? Well, Tiffany's been trained by the best people her daddy's money can buy, Cole, so obviously we can expect greatness. But on top of that, she also possesses a combination of impressive strength and athleticism that I'm sure we'll see in action here tonight. Throws her back in from ringside. She's in danger of a count out here. I don't know if she cares. The champ taking their share of hits now. Tying up the legs here, looking for the death lock. There it is. Oh, we got to see a tap. Hooked up. A ferocious attack against Tiffany here. Now we have to see how tough Tiffany truly can be. Big leg drop. It's humiliating. Oh, oh stink face. I think I'm going to be sick. <laughs> Hazardous position as Stratton gains her footing. <laughs> Stopped in their tracks with a knee to the gun. DDT. Big shot in the corner from Stratton. And it appears to be tippy time. Cool. The champ was glazed over. And Tiffany Stratton has just reached the top of the mountain. Here is your winner and the new WWE Women's Champion, Tiffany Stratton. She won the title. She's the champ. Safe to say, things did not go to plan here tonight. Yeah, no one ever plans on losing their title. Damian Priest has arrived. A man who will bring judgment to all of WWE. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day. From New York City, weighing in at 249 pounds, Damian Priest. Priest is bristling with confidence as always. Damien doesn't think there's anyone who could truly stand up to him. A Money in the Bank winner, multiple championship reigns. Priest's resume does speak for itself. And it says, I am to be feared. The unbridled power of Damien Priest is about to be unleashed. Hopefully his competition is prepared for what's about to come.
Finn Balor has arrived. Say hello to the Prince of Judgment. And his opponent, representing the Judgment Day. From Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, one half of the World Tag Team Champions, Finn Balor. A man with amazing high-flying skills, unmatched stamina, and a physique carved out of marble. It's good to be the Prince. I find it amusing, Corey, that despite all those gifts you mentioned, he still requires constant backup in the form of the Judgment Day. Is it Balor's fault that so many competitors want to sit under the learning tree of one of the greatest competitors of this generation? If you ask me, he's not teaching them the right lessons. He's got all the skill in the world, but the Judgment Day never plays by the rules. All you need to see are the titles, the main events, the accolades earned by the Judgment Day. Balor's teaching all the right lessons, and the Judgment Day has executed them to perfection. A victory tonight over Damian Priest not only protects his career, but supercharges his superstardom. But in the end, it was all Balor. Hard hitting, no holding back. I can't wait to see this again. Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling reviews, recaps, and music the video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe. And it's for the WWE Women's World Championship. The erratic 
Undertaker has arrived. Ready to pass judgment on the women's division. on the face of the Eradicator. You can call it evil, but it's also effective, competing on an even higher level since joining the Judgment Day. I hate to say it, Corey, but you're right. Absolute dominance from Rhea Ripley as of late. Cold expression on her face tells you all you need to know about Rhea Ripley. Rhea has complete confidence in herself. Here's a woman who lives to fight. Liv Morgan likes to say, watch me. Well, she's about to get what she wants because tonight it's all eyes on her. Indeed, we're gonna watch Liv and see what she's capable of here tonight. She looks fired up. Introducing the challenger from Adelaide, Australia, Rhea Ripley! And her opponent from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, the WWE Women's World Champion, Liv We see it there, the Women's World Championship, the reward for coming out on top in this match. A symbol of dominance for the woman who possesses the coveted title. And here we go, these women ready to push themselves further than ever before, all in the name of being the Women's World Champion. Each woman is more than happy to mix it up and go places she's never been in order to leave here with the gold. Well, this looks like it's gonna be another certified banger. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Uh-oh. We're gonna see it. What power. Sit down, power bomb. Being dropped like that can leave the champion in severe trouble. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. Wrecking the shoulder. Look at this, just stop after stop after stop. Taking all their frustrations out of the champion and doing so in the most inelegant way possible. And a slap, too. Ripley unloading on her opponent. This is where Morgan will be tested. <laughs> Brought back into the ring from the floor now. was vicious. She's on unsteady legs in the corner. Needs to recover. Monkey flip! All measured up. Drop kick to the back. Ooh, dropped right on their 
face. Jarring stop. Well, Morgan looks fired up taking on Rhea Ripley. Will that emotion be a help or a hindrance here? Liv has always thrived off of raw emotion, so I think it will help her counter Rhea's power game. If she's able to absorb punishment and keep the momentum going, Morgan has a real shot at this one. Stalling suplex. Cover by the challenger. She powers out immediately there. Keeping a loss at bay for now. Receiving end. Oh, what a shoot. That'll fillet your chest. Some hard offense landing on the champ. And you can just tell Ripley enjoyed delivering that punishment. Here we go. Ripley just pushed the hands of time on the Doomsday Clock with that move. Now is not the time to wallow in disbelief. Pressure must be kept on. Using their boot. Reversal from Morgan. A jumping stop to the gut. Boom! Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Measured kick to the vertebrae. Oh, driven face first. May have taken a moment to see if fans will show some love. Lands face first. Right to the spine. Ripley in a surprising bit of danger. This is what it feels like to run into a competitor like Morgan. May have taken a moment to see if fans will show some love. She saw it coming. Big boot. Jeez. Setting up our opponent. Here it comes. The we can have a new champion. Cover. Yes, got it. New champion. Deej around the title. It still carries a history of its previous iteration, and that's quite the history of title holders. Yeah, Byron, it's a title. The champion into the cover. She's not going to go that quietly. Now, oh, trampling the opposition. Right to the leg. Impressive reversal there. Just breaking down the opponent. And now Rhea is in a compromised position. Ripley has to stop struggling. Classic strategy, cutting your opponent down to size. The challenger eating up some damage. Hard work paying off for Liv. No secret that Rhea Ripley possesses terrifying strength. Does that give her an upper hand tonight? Absolutely. Rhea's ability to overpower the competition and throw her out the ring gives her an instant advantage. If she can get control over her opponent, this could be a quick match. Oh, Ripley put a stop to that. Uh-oh. Watch out. Oh, shoulder first. And the ring just shifted. And she knew Ripley's game plan. It's the drop kick. And that risk gained big rewards. Knee strike! Rhea Ripley turning up the intimidation factor. Oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. 
And Liv is the one being challenged here. Oh my God, what a kick. Great awareness as she proves to be too quick. Big move by Liv. That's how you claim the spotlight for yourself. And gets tossed back into the mat. Ref still counting, close to calling it. Hurry back in from the top. Elbow drop. The champ shoulders down now. Is it enough to retain the championship? Oh, somehow she's still in this one. She returns the favor there. Oh, right, now she's looking to apply the pressure with this submission maneuver. Abdominal stretch. We're going to find an escape from the abdominal stretch. Uh-oh, found it. <laughs> Drop kick. Great athleticism. Kick. Stick kick. Uh-oh, well scouted by Ripley. Scoop slam. Jumping complete shot. Face first. Now that is why they're the champ. Shoulders down. No, title still hangs in the balance. This is going to come down to who wants it more. Catches the kick into a dragon screw leg whip. Firm control. Big boot. Now a pin for the championship. And she towards the pin attempt in one. She is still in this fight. Oh! Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Force her opponent into submission. Submission locked in. Liv Morgan, tremendous heart. And she is determined to escape. Liv Morgan not backing down. Not now, not ever. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. She wants to finish this. Take off. Champion finally ready to put this one away. Forces the shoulder after two. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Catches them with a jawbreaker. We are getting everyone in attendance to rally behind her. And a slap for the exclamation point. Uh-oh, arms are trapped. No way to protect themselves. Oh, stop it, stop it, stop, jeez. Headed to the top rope. Up high. And Rhea knowing she has to pull out all the stops now.
Things are about to get good. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first, from Los Angeles, California, weighing in at 303 pounds, Jacob Fletcher. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. Nevada, weighing in at 250 pounds, Solo Sikoa! The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one.
the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes looking to continue his dominance in WWE. Competing at his highest level, striving for the main event, and the biggest prize. in the name of the Rhodes family. Make way for the head of the table. I think we can all agree we are seeing a once-in-a-lifetime competitor. And representing the bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman Reigns! Over 1,200-plus days as Universal Champion, the third longest reigning world champion in WWE history. Three plus years of dominance. Dozens of successful title defenses. Yeah, it's got to feel like pure intimidation when you are facing Roman Reigns. It may even feel like victory is virtually impossible. Reigns is firmly established as the head of the table and has no intention of being unseated. You can love him, or you can hate him, but you must acknowledge him. A certified GOAT competing at his all-time best. Reigns is now an unstoppable force. Team match is sure to be filled with exciting action. These teams want the win bad tonight, and they'll fight hard to get it. Yeah, these superstars look like they're all business, not a weak link among them. Bang, a tiger fake kick. And an inverted atomic drop. Roman Reigns gets the tag. Just a ruthless streak. Why not a fair fight, huh? That hit connects from Roman Reigns. Oh, that is going to leave a mark. Look at Reigns, top rope. Here we go. Got the elbow drop. Came down like a lead balloon. He is 
just getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. Like it caught. Roman Reigns, look at this. Just clothesline after clothesline, destroying his opponent. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. That signature hard-hitting style of Roman Reigns. Across the top rope. Clubbing forward. Look at him totally vibing with the WWE Universe right now. Drop kick. Great athleticism. Up the rope. Beautiful all the way down to the outside. Throwing all caution to the wind and leaping to the outside. Assistance. And he gets tossed back into the mat. Catches a punch. Uh oh, reversal. Can he take advantage? He foiled that attempt. Before the one count. He couldn't make much of that pin attempt. Oh, man. Roman Reigns giving the people in attendance the chance to acknowledge him. And tag, he's in now. Finally. What power from the tribal chief. A power bomb like that will leave you with bruises and remind you of this moment for days. Roman Reigns with a schoolboy pinning combination. No! What power! No muss, no fuss on that delivery. Someone clearly doesn't want this match to go on much longer than it has to. He's getting a little battered now. Using the ropes. Big forearm. As the arms hook has a punt. And down for a Tiger Jogger 98. That was the most dangerous position for any competitor to ever be in. You gotta hope there was no damage done. Got and he goes for the pen. He narrowly avoids the count. He's determined to keep this matchup going. Springboard into a hurricane run. That's amazing. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Uh-oh, look out. Double leg drop. Cody's heart being put to a test now. Quick jab by Cody and a bionic elbow. <laughs> Have to head back into the ring now. Yeah, count's running out. Just to beat the count. Bad spot for Rose. Dragon twist cut. Terrible position for Rose. The sound of this crowd is deafening, and he's asking for more. Oh, elbow right to the bread basket for their troubles. To the corner now. 
with the hole of the arm, a chop for good measure. Not done yet. What agility. Nice arm drag. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. He made it. Tag made. It's that time. A pin drop. Really challenging the tribal chief with that. Uh-oh. Dropping the knee for more punishment. A relentless attack being brought to Roman. Roman's being picked apart. Set up for a second time. Oh, Dragon twist cut. That is what it takes to topple Reigns. Two. Oh, kicks out. Kicks out. Reigns kicks out at two and nine tenths. The travel chief stays alive. All of that work, all these big moves, and it still didn't earn the fall. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. a victory for the team, especially Roman Reigns, who really helped put this one away. Put that match in a museum or a textbook so future teams can study to learn this craft. Revamp Wrestling. Bringing you videos on all wrestling, reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe.